Captain? Major. This is my partner. All set? Did you have anything special in mind? Oh, I don't care, just... Dark hair. Oh, yes. Uh, Holly would like dark hair. Hi. Hi. Don't tell me your name. Let me guess. Melissa. No. Juliet. Betty? No. I'll just call you Beauty, okay? Oh, that's nice. Thank you. Sit down. Are you one of those volleyballers? Marjorie! <gasps> it's him. <gasps> you tried to rape me. Help me. What did I say about talking? Jesus Christ. Marjorie, what are you doing? We've got to call the police. Oh, what charge? Rape. There was no rape. The attempted rape. You can't so prove attempted rape. We should call the police now. Do it. Animal ripped it out of the wall. Uh, I'll go in the car. No. no. Terry? In the car. No, Terry. I can't prove anything. The police have to let him go. He said he'd come back and get us. Us, Terry. Me, you, Pat. You would have found me dead. And he'd rape you. Don't do this to me. You have to help me. What can I do? Help me make him disappear. Let's wait for Pat. No, we don't need Pat. We only need the shovel. Shovel? To dig the hole. Oh, my God. Choose. Him or us. Choose. Him or us. I just want out of all this. I just want out. That's all. Out of what? This marriage? Yeah. Well, I have to think about that. There's not a lot for you to think about, Sonny. Yeah. Just want to get on with it. And you just, you know, keep your hands where they are, okay? Don't. What? <laughs> what do you want to get on with? My life. That's it. Well, I'm gonna tell you something. I might make a little noise about all this. You know that, don't you? Yeah, I imagine you will. Nobody better mess with my children, especially any puny-ass youth minister. You hear me? Nobody will. I assure you that. I wouldn't make too much over this if I were you. I certainly know as much about what you do and have done as you think I do. And you know that? Yeah, I guess I do. <laughs> yeah. What? Hmm? It's okay. Hold on. It's okay, baby. Won't you get out on your knees with me one more time, just this last time? Why, Sonny? Come on, Jesse. Why, Sonny? I want, I, want, I want us to pray together. Understanding and loving understanding for possible future reconciliation for us and for our son and daughter. No, Sonny, it's come not on, Jesse. The time. Jesse, come on. Sonny, I don't want no, to pray with you maybe, today. No, no, tomorrow, maybe next week. No. All right. Let's see. Pull your son. Well, he never had a problem 
We haven't been able to solve when we get down to it. He's and you know that. He's giving me my answers. Look, <laughs> sir, like Chagall, it's moody. This is the land. This is the sky. What's that? Um, the sun? Maybe a big Martian? Look, be a fool. Could I paint it? What? No, go away. We're playing a game. Oh, oh, keep doing that. Anyway, it's like Chagall. There's the best storm. Where's the Chagall? Where's the storm? Well, there's the Matisse right there. I don't, I don't, I don't care. Hi. Hey! Oh, God, you! <laughs> oh, you pain! Oh, gosh! You look great. Okay, gosh! Look who came! Oh, tonight was really fun. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know you could dance like that. Well, I learned it from my mother. Oh, was she a dancer? Yeah. Ballet? Belly. Oh. <laughs> What's wrong? Um, can I be honest with you? Sure. Okay, Craig, I think you're a really nice guy. It's just that, um, nice is not what I'm looking for. I don't understand that. What are you looking for? Well... When I saw your show, I really wanted to meet you. Um, I, something about you really turned me on. <laughs> My sense of humor? No. Boyish charm? Uh, not exactly. My sensitivity towards women? The love master. Greg, I want the love master. That's just a character from my act. You... That's not really me. But you, I mean, can you? I just want to see. Oh. Oh, come on. The love master. You really don't want him? Oh. Then you really don't want me. Good night. Thanks, anyway. Sex, isn't it? Please, Ben, I'm your mother. You don't have to pretend. I already know women reach their sexual peak in their 30s. Where'd you pick up that kind of stuff? Donahue. I'm getting rid of the television set. Hey, how about this? Oh, good one. Anyway, it's not just about sex. I think it'd be a good idea for you to have an adult male around the house as a role model. Well, what if he turns out to be like Dad, splits with his secretary? It's not like your dad. Anyway, his secretary is about 100 years old. Yeah, but what if he turns out to be a serial killer and tries to boil our heads in acid? You're stretching, Benjamin. That could happen. This is just a trial period, and Jack's going to keep his own apartment. So if for some reason things don't work out, he'll go back to his place. And you and I we will go back to the way we were. Okay. Did you know he actually irons his jeans? Yes. And I'm sure you're going to tell me that makes him an axe murderer. Well, I don't know that for sure. All I'm saying is that a compulsion like that generally indicates a deeper psychosis. I heard it on Geraldo. <sighs> Look, Ben. I love Jack. I'd like to have a husband again, but you're the most important man in my life. And if it doesn't work for you, it doesn't work for me. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. But I still think you might try and boil our heads in acid. <laughs> 